oh my god so two things three things one I legitimately have to go to work any minute now and this came in the mail finally and number two I'm not dressed for work at all so try to ignore everything my hair and makeup is done but I'm just not dressed yet everything's still in the dryer and I'm just like a hot mess ah, second of all I realized I can film with my camera charging I could not do that with my Sony, so that's a very big plus for this camera. I just have to sit on this side of my room. Normally you guys see that side of my room. Um, so you can see my Christmas tree in my room, yay. So I hope the lighting isn't too bad. It's literally like so dark out and crappy and everything. And I'm just, I, I'm excited right now. This, from the title, is my very, very, very first Mac haul. I won $250 to Mac. And I only used, I think, 100 of it, 120 of it. So I still have about 100 left and I'm so excited. So... It says, this is the box that came in. Oh my God, I'm so excited right now. I, this is my first impression. I've never touched a MAC product. I've never seen like seen one in person. I've just been so against it because it's so expensive. And you know me and my affordability. So no, I probably would never pay for this stuff with my own money, but this I'm just so excited for. So it comes in black wrapping and then it has, oh, it's all like wrapped up so nicely. Ah, I love this. Okay, oh, there's like a, there's a card. Okay, hold on. To Caitlin from Jeremy. Merry Christmas. What? Okay, I think they gave me the wrong card because that's not the no. That, that is not what I ordered at all. Anyway, look at the packaging that it came in. I hope this is my stuff. They just gave me the wrong, like, I hope this is the right stuff. It seems like the right stuff. Okay, so it seems like the right stuff. I don't know what the Christmas card said to Caitlin from Jeremy. I, I don't know, whatever. So it came in this, it comes in this really cute bag. Oh my freaking god, I'm touching MAC products right now. Okay, so let me just die of like extreme happiness. Oh my god, I'm like panicking. Okay, this is a MAC satin lipstick in meth. This is, okay, I ordered all this, so I don't know why I'm like freaking out about the color. Oh my god. God. Oh my flipping God. Oh my God. Oh my God. It is literally a back lipstick. Whew. Okay. I don't have time for this. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I was like watching Pink Sparkles like um her MAC collection and try-ons and everything and I decided these are the ones that I wanted and this is the one in Myth. It is so gorgeous. Oh my God. I'm about to swatch a MAC lipstick. <gasps> oh my God. Okay. So it's a little orangey. It's Hope it doesn't come up this orangey on the lips, but that's okay. You know what? That's okay. It's pretty. Um, I can work with it. It's so creamy. <gasps> it blends out really nicely. Um, it's coming up a little bit more orange on screen, but that's okay. This is really pretty. I'm just so excited right now. Okay. And this next one is in Snob. Ah, so if you guys understand, like, what back-to-back -back means or whatever, let me know. I know nothing about MAC. If you guys have anything, you know, I know that something about the AIDS Foundation, like they do stuff for AIDS or whatever. I, I'm not sure about anything, so if you guys know a lot about MAC, please just tell me what you know below so that I can, you know, I know what's going on. This is another satin lipstick in Snob. <gasps> this is gorgeous! Okay, so we're gonna swatch this one. Oh, yes, honey. Yes. <gasps> yes! That is gorge. Okay, super exciting. This, this is so cool. This is just the coolest thing that's ever happened to me. Um, okay. And it's all like wrapped really nicely. <gasps> These are like all lipsticks. I forgot how much. I think I ordered like really only lipsticks. This is a frost lipstick in All I Want. Okay, so this is the Mariah Carey um, from the Christmas collection, All I Want. So I did want to order something from the Christmassy collection and I thought the packaging would be different, but I guess not. So, oh, that's so cute. Okay, so it's just a very frostic color. Ooh, pretty. <gasps> I feel like that's gonna be really pretty to add on top of like a lipstick. So that's that one. It's very sheer and very shimmery. I think it'll be really pretty to add on top of like a red color like this. I feel like it would look really good just to add on top. Ooh, very frostic and pretty, I like. And I like how they don't feel sticky. They feel really nice, really, 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 really good formula. Loving this already. And then this one is a lip gloss. Ooh, an angel. I'm so excited. So, oh my god. This is just so pretty. I can't believe it. This is so cute. So this is a MAC lip gloss. Ooh, smells like cookies. Do their lipsticks smell that way? 
No, but they don't smell bad. This smells like cookies. Oh my God. Oh my God, that's gorgeous. Is it sticky though? It's a little sticky, but it's a lip gloss. So what do you expect? They're very shiny. Ooh, I like the color. This is so exciting and oh my god, I'm like flipping out right now. Okay. So this is a frost lipstick in Angel, which is actually supposed to match this. So that's why I got the matching lip gloss. Ooh, it doesn't look as frostic as the other one, but this is so pretty. Look at this. Ah, okay. Ooh, I like how it's not as um the lip gloss, I feel like, is a lot darker. This is the Frostic Lip Gloss, so I'm sure they would look really good together. This definitely looks like an everyday lip lipstick that I could wear. Um, This is the one that I heard Kim Kardashian wears almost every single day. So, And I'm not a big Kardashian person. It's just cool to have something that, you know, someone actually uses. And the packagings are gorgeous. And this is a Amplified Cream Lipstick in St. Germain. Oh my god, okay, you guys ready for this? I'm about to freak out right now. I'm about to scream of excitement. This is St. Germain. Okay, I've been wanting to see what St. Germain looks like for like three years now in person. Okay, you guys ready? I don't know if you're ready. I don't know if I'm ready. Oh my god. Okay, so it's definitely more of like a blue pink. Oh my god. This is me. This is gorgeous. I was definitely thinking, hoping, or thinking more of a purple because when I was doing dupes after like not even seeing it, I was actually gearing more towards like the purple lilacs. This is not anything at all like that. This is gorgeous. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is me. This is me. This is me. 100% this is me. This is definitely a blue tone lipstick. I wish I wasn't wearing a lip stain right now. Oh my god, St. Germain, I'm so excited. Okay, so this is like Pink Sparkles is like holy grail lipstick, at least it was for a long time. I think it's like myth now or something. But this was the one that I was dying over lusting. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. Can I wait to show Chris this later? Oh my god, this is the Max Studios nail lacquer. It's in St. Germain as well because I wanted to get everything in St. Germain. And this is, oh my god. Oh. Oh, I've never had a high-end nail polish. The closest I've had to high-end nail polish is OPI. Uh, but something I've like received, I had some Butter London and X formulas, but I've never had something from like a department store like Macy's or Estee Lauder or anything like that. So this is definitely, oh my god, and it's gorgeous and it matches the lipstick so perfectly. Oh, I love it. I wish they would make it in a blush and everything in like a lip liner and oh my god, I'm just like dying right now. So this is like a very velvety top and hold on, let's see. Oh, that is gorgeous. It looks sort of sheer, so I'm probably going to need a few coats of this, but that is so okay. I'm very excited. Once my nails heal from everything that's happened to them, I'm definitely going to be using this, so I'm very excited about that. And this is a, I think this was... This was the sample that I picked out, the MAC Prep and Prime Skin Base. Oh my god, it's just a base, so I'm not going to look at that just because it's so small. Ah, this is a St. Germain lip gloss, okay. Ah, this is so cool. Okay, so, oh my god. I'm like in love. I'm so in love, I'm so, 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 so in love. Hold on, wipe it off my hand. So in love. Okay, so this is the St. Germain lip gloss. Oh my god, you guys. This is so perfect. <gasps> it's sheer, but I love it. I feel like this is something I'm, I can keep in my purse with me. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I always thought these were bigger. So $17 for something that's not this big kind of sketches me out a bit, but whatever. I did not pay for this stuff. And I am so freaking grateful and amazed that I even got any of this and this is the last thing that I picked out and I had to pick out a blush this is a sheer tone blush in gingerly I wanted so much more but I really wanted to try the Saint Germain stuff and this is the um I I'm crazy about blush blush is my favorite thing in the whole world so I got a blush and it's in gingerly and it was either this or peony puddle and I figured a little bit something a little more um like bronzy and something like that like oh my god <gasps> This is insanity. I would use this like every single day. This is so pretty. This is so me. It's gorgeous. I love it. And I've never like seen or like touched the MAC packaging before. I'm dying. I'm just dying right now. I'm, oh my God. Like, I think that's it. I honestly think that's it. Um, yep, that's it. So I got everything that 
I'm, I'm so excited. I'm mostly excited about Myth, I think. Myth and St. Germain. I just can't even right now. Is, which, is this the St. Germain lip gloss? It is. I'm totally going to put it on over this. Mmm. It smells so good. Mmm. It feels so good on the lips. Probably didn't do much for the color because I do have a really red lip stain on right now. Oh my god, this is fantastic. I'm so happy. I'm so in love. I cannot believe I just did my very first MAC haul. This is insanity, you guys. Insanity. And I just, I'm obsessed and I cannot wait to show Chris when I get out of work tonight. Oh my god, this is just everything I could ever want. So, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for supporting me and loving me and helping me through the years with my YouTube channel and everything. And I have so much stuff planned for 2016. I'm so excited right now. Okay, so I love you guys so, so much and have a great day.